the Chronic Pain Coalition presents Honey as a Treatment for the Painful Bladder Syndrome. This year, in 2011, the American Urological Society released uh, press information about a possible new treatment for interstitial cystitis for the painful bladder syndrome based on the very ancient medicine honey. They described a study of British researchers where they analyzed the influence of a specific medicine honey, which is totally sterile, on the behavior of the mast cell. And this is a model of a mast cell. Mast cells you can find in great numbers in the bladder wall, and mast cells release various compounds which are all irritating and induce pain, such as histamine and tnf alpha. The mast cell in the bladder wall has gone berserk. And to treat this mast cell, it is not very easy. Happily, there are two supplements we in Europe very often prescribe, based on palmitoyl eclonamide. And now there might be a new therapy based on the irrigation of the bladder with a honey solution. These researchers in the UK looked into the effect of honey on the mast cell and they compared it to the effects of sugar water on the mast cell. And indeed they found that in all cases where they used medicinal honey that the mast cell was inhibited and did not release any histamine. So it looks very promising. However, these were studies done in models and not in patients. So it's too early to start irrigating the bladder with a solution of honey. Certainly not normal honey, because this is full with bacteria you do not want to have in your bladder. But also not with medicinal honey, because honey is very sweet and first we have to find out whether if you irrigate the bladder with a solution of sweet honey, whether this does not induce an overgrowth of candida or bacteria. So basically the balance between efficacy and safety of a medicinal honey solution in the treatment of painful bladder syndrome has to be evaluated in a human clinical trial. Presented to you by the Coalition of Chronic Pain, Dr. Keppel Hesselink.